Prophet Muhammad a mercy to the world. His humility. His humility. Ibn Abbas relates, Abbas relates the Apostle of God, Apostle peace be upon him and his family, would sit upon the earth and eat upon the earth. He would milk the ewe and respond to the invitation to food of the freeman and slave, even for the simple trotter meal. Imam Sadiq, peace be upon him, relates, whenever the Apostle of God entered a meeting place, he would always sit in the lowliest place in the gathering. The Prophet's wife was asked, what does the Prophet do in private? She said, he sews his clothes and mends his shoes and does what a man usually does when he's with his wife. He used to say, there are five things I will not stop doing until I die. Eating on the floor with the servants, riding on the saddle of a donkey, milking goats with my hand, wearing wool, and greeting children, so that these may become traditions of humility for others after I am gone. Imam Hassan, peace be upon him, in a tradition about the manners of the Apostle of God says, No, I swear by God Almighty that he would never lock himself behind doors, nor let the doormen or guards keep him concealed. He would not be occupied by being served with morning or afternoon meals, but rather he was in full view of the people. Whoever wished to meet the Prophet of God could do so. He would sit upon the ground and place his food on the ground and wear rough clothes and ride upon a donkey and let others ride behind him. It is related that Ibn Abi Awfa said, The Apostle of God did not disdain or consider himself to be above walking with widows or paupers and fulfilling their needs. Anas ibn Malik relates, No one was more beloved to his companions than the Apostle of God. When they saw him, they would never stand up as they knew how much he hated that.